Hey YouTube, ready to see some livestock? Stay tuned. Alright YouTube, this is Brian coming at you with another episode of the 125 gallon reef build. And what I'm going to show you today is the first couple of fish that I put in the tank as well as a cleanup crew. As you can see, the tank is very much covered in diatoms right now. The sand, the glass, everything. The other night I did put in a couple of turbo snails and a couple of trochus snails, as well as some hermit crabs of different varying types. Uh, that was just the start, but uh, it needed a lot more. So what I've got drip acclimating here are some more trochus. Um, some more hermits and a couple of um, or four of these um, uh, blanking out of the name it starts with an A Asteria snails I believe so they're drip acclimating and we're going to add them in a second hopefully that should start to work um, obviously I'll just clean the glass myself as well but um, just to, for the tank to mature, I've decided to leave it and let nature take its course uh, to start with. Um, the other thing is, as you can see, there's two fish in the tank. I've got a chocolate tang and a pink tail trigger. These are not going to be permanent uh, fixtures in the tank, but um, I've got a local saltwater shop that was going out of business and these were each ten dollars um, for five to six inch fish of this quality I couldn't pass it up and I knew that my cycle was complete but that I probably wasn't going to be buying um, the permanent fish anytime soon so I figured for 20 bucks let's go ahead and grab these and they'll keep the tank cycle for the time being Nothing against either of these, especially, I mean, I really like the chocolate tang. Um, the trigger, not as much, plus the trigger will eat corals more than likely. However, the chocolate tang probably will not go well with the fish that I do plan on eventually getting. We'll talk about that as we get them. But anyway, I just wanted to do this brief video and show you. Um, again, cleanup crew being added. Hopefully diatoms will be gone soon, but it is just a normal part of uh, a new tank maturing. And here are some of the, I just was able to see some of the hermits that are in the tank already that I talked about from the other night. There's one big turbo in the back. But yeah, um, corals to follow soon. I'm just holding off a little bit. Um, in order to incur the expenses of uh, the fish and the corals, saving up a little bit of money, that type of thing. But uh, soon you'll see some livestock, some additional livestock in the tank. Uh, until next time, stay tuned. Thanks everybody that watches these videos. Thanks to all my subscribers. If you're new to this channel, make sure you do subscribe. And uh, yeah, that's it for now. Thanks.